these patients, while the base procedure may be covered by OHIP, uh, there could be room for upselling. The Premier didn't detail any precautions to prevent against that. Richard Southern City News. You are listening to City News 6 8. Well, Sickies Hospital says it is going to bump up their surgeries today after delaying or pausing many last year. In mid-November, the country's largest pediatric hospital ran down surgeries in order to redeploy staff to its overwhelmed intensive care unit and emergency department. And it wasn't the only one. Pediatric hospitals across the province had to cancel surgeries in order to deal with a major surge in flu cases and respiratory illnesses. Sickies now has to work to clear a backlog of more than six in addition to canceling surgeries, pediatric hospitals, including sick kids, sent teenagers to adult ICUs to create space for critically ill children. It was an unprecedented response that the president of sick kids tells the Toronto Star is the single reason why this crisis has not become a catastrophe, adding it prevented a sentinel death event for children. Another hospital official says these past few months have been the most challenging in its history. Laura Carney, City News. City News Time 1105. A transit advocacy group says the tax on parking at big malls and commercial lots.